Hello, Jim Ritter here. J Ritter 660 on YouTube. James A. Ritter on Facebook. It's um, warm enough in the car that you need the air conditioner on if you have the windows up. If you have the windows down, it's actually cool enough to have not have the car running. So. But what's louder, the noise of traffic or the noise of the vehicle running? So we're going to opt with the road noise. I've been sitting here for a while and it can get loud, but right now it seems to be doing okay. Cool, cool. Um, this is current video 1010. We are moving right along. Actually, in my videos, I am falling behind by a little bit, and to get nine more videos up this week and I have three left over from last week I have 12 videos to do before 1020 but I will allow myself to fall a little bit behind because I'm so far ahead so I could do five minute projects like the project that we had that I had going to Disney, which is going to start on the 10th. So let's see, this is the 2nd, so next week will probably be, what, around the 8th or 9th, so just after the next current video starts that project. And come January 1st, that project will expound to two a day. And I think you'll find it interesting or terribly boring, one or the other, but I know I will enjoy it, and uh, I think it'll be beneficial for people who've never been to Disney to see exactly how it is just to go from point to point to point, because there's all kinds of videos out there, but there's no real way for a person to comprehend where in the park that video is being taken. And so this will hopefully make things a little bit more comprehensive or comprehensible. Comprehend? Comprehensible? Yeah. Gotcha. Um, usually I like to keep these videos going a little longer than my five minute segments. I try to get it to run my ten, ten minute segments because you, you're seeing me currently. Like, this is Tuesday, so tomorrow will be Wednesday when you see this video, so... And that uh, you're so far behind me that uh, I like to update you once a week and keep you updated. Oh, part of that is we have 16,000, almost 900 views. Didn't make 17 by the 1st of December. So I doubt very much that we'll make 18,000 by the views by the end of this month because right now I'm my drop my average has dropped from about 925 back to 850 so that would probably put me around 17,750 views by the end of the year which is pretty good I have 53 subscribers of those 53 subscribers 
around two thirds of them uh, allow me to be able to view who they are and the other third doesn't so that list that you saw me go through last week if you remember last week where I um, gave a shout out to all my subscribers that's why I didn't have 53 subscribers because some of them don't allow you to show who they are which is fine people like to keep their privacy and I have no problem with that so um, I have a pretty solid group of probably I would guesstimate five to ten people that watch me a little more than periodically they don't watch every single video I don't think anyone watches every single video which is not a requirement by any means but things are actually getting better and better except for the views but the views are like when I first started like way first started the analytics said that people were only watching for 30 seconds now they're watching on average about two and a half minutes and I limit my uh, time to average out to about five minutes on average how I do this is on the side of my camera I have a counter that says how many minutes I've gone and then when I shut it off I check to see that it's at the five minute mark of time remaining on the um, card on the video card uh, SD card there we go and that was another thing that I learned through time is the terminology like to get these videos to you I upload them to you and then uh, if you want to keep them on your computer there is a way and I've never done it I don't download any videos I once to watch to kind of watch so <laughs> I just watch them daily so I sort of skim the surface that's what you call um, oh I can't think of the name of it see the terminology but uh, the computer has this like when you watch these videos you'll see that uh, there's a little gray line in front of the red line um, that is just allowing you to watch the video without storing any of the information on or much of the information on the computer I'm sure the government can find markers to see what you've watched which is okay because I try to watch family oriented things and um, as testing out different people that I've never seen before I may watch for a while I even watch some people who have vulgar language through their whole videos but um, usually they're not super vulgar all the way through so and I try not to be um, I can't say that I haven't let a few uh, expletives go through but I think of the 1010 videos that I've done that um, I think you couldn't count more than the fingers on both hands how, how, how many times I've slipped up which is fantastic um, I will tell you that my current videos do get the most views um, my average views average between 5 and 10 for my regular videos and these ones come in at uh, 10 to 15 sometimes 20 views so it's obvious that a lot of people just wait till Wednesday not a lot but a few of my viewers mainly wait till Wednesday a current video to see what's going on and don't bother with the rest and that again is perfectly fine 
Um, actually, if you're wondering where I'm at right now, Tina has an appointment with a doctor. I don't know what for. She sees a lot of doctors. Um, this one's the first time for this doctor. Actually, that's another thing she misses from up north because she's got all her ducks in a row up north, all her doctors lined up. And so she's got to restart down here. But this area is, this is Kissimmee, but it's a huge subdivision called Hunter's Creek. So they, there's a lot of neighborhoods that get sort of nicknames. There's one over there uh, to the west of us called Four Corners. There's no place really called Four Corners. It's just a nickname of four different cities that are right in that, connect in that, that area and it's sort of like Four Corners of four different towns. So that's how come it got the name Four Corners. But in each area in that Four Corners actually does have a city that it is in. So, well I'm going to go ahead and let you go. So don't forget to subscribe down below, leave a thumbs up, share with your friends. Have a great and wonderful day. TTFN. Bye-bye.